dude is always waiting outside for some goddamn water. Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. Yes, sir. Hold, Hold it right, right there. there. State, State your business, business in Rivet City. City. And, and who, who might, might your father be? If he lives on this boat, I know. Dr. Lee, eh? Well, then I guess you'd have to ask Dr. Lee for more information. Go on up, then. She's probably in the science lab. But keep your nose clean, you hear me? Yes, sir. Thanks for the help. Carry, Carry on, on. Then. Is this marketplace? No. Good old Rivet City. Let, Let me or a security officer know if you see anything out of the ordinary. Where we go? Science lab. Science lab. Definitely gotta check out some other things though. Other than the science lab. I'm like right there, damn it. Nope. One little shoe, son of a bitch. Ah, come on. All that for some and some jet. Everything looks okay here. What is in here? Sleep for one hour. Let's do this. All right, I'm all back. Back together. Okay. Science lab down this way. Science lab. All right. Empty foot lockers. Save lives. And your constant interruption is a serious effort. 
Now please, stand aside. Look, this is a restricted area. I'm tired of telling you people. I... it's you. My heavens, you look so much like him. You're James's son, aren't you? What are you doing here? Wait, how do you know who I am? You were too young to remember, and I suppose James never spoke of me. Typical. I am Dr. Madison Lee. I worked with your parents many years ago. Now, I run the science lab here in Rivet City. It was all I had left. When your mother died, your father decided to leave with you. He abandoned our work. We had no choice but to do the same. Try to find my father. Have you seen You mean him? you haven't? I assumed he sent you here. For that matter, aren't you supposed to be in a vault? James said he left you there. Yeah. What the hell? There, yeah. Did you? I was under the impression that's exactly the opposite of what he wanted for you. Well, you won't find him here. He's come and gone already. Your father insisted that we return to work on Project Purity. I tried telling him too much time has passed. There's no way it would work. Predictably, he refused to listen to me. He says he can prove it will work and head it off to the old lab. I'm sorry, I don't know what else to tell you. It's in the old Jefferson Memorial Building, northwest of here. Please, don't go after him. It was foolish of him to even think about going there alone. All right. Good luck. The technology in that android you there. What are you, some kind of lab assistant? No, you look a bit more weathered. Are you by any chance for hire? This could be an opportunity of a lifetime for you. I've misplaced some very sensitive property, and you will help me find it. Yeah, what kind of property? Understand. All you know of robots are those buckets of bolts, those Mr. Handshakers and whatnot. Well, that's not all a robot can be. You see, in the Commonwealth, we've made artificial persons, synthetic humanoids, programmed to think and feel and do whatever we need. And occasionally, they get confused and wander off. Isn't it quite clear? You are to locate my android. He must have done something drastic, like facial surgery and a mind wipe, or else I would have found him by now. It will be no easy task. He may not even realize he's an android. Don't upset him by talking with him. Just come get me immediately. I'll handle it. Of course! I have at my disposal advanced technology from the Commonwealth. I'd be willing to share some of it with you. Just think, you'll be the envy of all your friends. Excellent. Locate my android, and you won't be disappointed. All right. Here, well, don't make me disappointed. Listen to this message he sent me. He's mocking me. I swear, I'll make him pay for that. To go. Of course. Hello. Alright. Let's go. Oh, yeah, switch this. Alright. Jefferson Memorial. Go to the. We're gonna trade some shit out first. See if we can find some good guns. There gotta be some good guns here. 
course, I don't remember. It's been so long. Marketplace. Everything looks okay here. Science Nothing I contact lab, security no. for. Yes. Oh, come on. Pay more attention. I'm Cindy. I mean, Cindy Cantelli. I'm a quick fix. I mean, I, I run a quick fix. Anyway, you were saying? Yeah, Polly and I. Our shop is in the market. Boy, that sounded dumb. Where else would our shop be? Anyway, thanks for being... The Muddy Rudder. Bell waters down the liquor, but it's cheap. It's on the lower deck. Muddy rudder. Why am I get it on the table? Oh man. So much stealing. No, I'm good. Take a little nap. Small nap. <clears throat> One of the new immigrants died of radiation. Hey. If you don't get fresh water soon, you'll all end up like her. Hey there. Yes, sir? To the marketplace, find a nice gun. We need to find a nice gun. For this marketplace, tis open. Have a seat anywhere. Someone will be with you in a minute. Welcome. This here is Flack and Shrapnel's gun shop. Pretty catchy, huh? Take a look around. Flag if you trap. see anything you like, I'll be right over here. Need to do some killing, eh? Ammo. 
40 rounds. It's energy cell. Oh, no. Let's do like... That's like 500. It's like 150. That'd be like... Do this. Mm -hmm. Railway spikes, forty five. Cigarettes, pre war money. Okay. Some beer, you can have that. Whiskey. Vodka. See what else we can find here. Get rid of that, that, jet. Six. Three of those. Rad X. I have five. Oh, shit. That's alright. Oh. Ooh, don't have enough. Hold on. Cuckoo, could you? Alright, I guess I have to get rid of one mini move. There we go. Alright. A pleasure doing business with you. Gotta run. If you need Welcome to Rivet City Supply. I've got a little bit of everything here. Alright, well. Let's go. They're all eating. 